the science guy.
The hamsters are traditionally kept on a bed of wood chips. <laughs> and these are well suited to this demonstration because they're thin. It's heavy, isn't it? So the fire triangle and Sarah, ladies and gentlemen. You watch the videos at school, thank you. Gosh, you must watch them well enough. Yes. Yes. Gosh, she just pulled the oxygen, if I may, right out of the air. Uh, all right. So, we have uh, Rob from Wonder Writers Laboratories, who's properly suited for this dangerous demonstration. Where's his bow tie? fire. Rob doesn't wear a bow tie. They're, it's a relaxed company. They focus on their business goals. He's business casual. Yes, Rob. Business casual. So, uh, wood chips are fuel. You may have known that wood burns. You may have seen wood burning. Uh, then we will have oxygen because this flask, this is called a distilling flask. It also resembles anyone who style a flask. A Florence flask, thank you. Okay, so it's a school. <laughs> you know what it is? Growing up just the earbuds, the playlist. They don't know what Florence flask is going anymore. It's alright. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry about me. It's okay. There's air in there with him which bears oxygen from the other things. And what we need is heat. And uh, we can get heat from our burner. I will wear the safety glasses to prevent it to go. <laughs> and we have some matches here. Rob has opened the valve. Have you opened the valve? He's opening the valve. Seconds away, moments away. Uh, uh, it's going. So uh, let's boost it, Rob. Boost it, Gary. That's I it's, it's well. Right? Boost it well. It's a I was paraphrasing the popular. Uh, so, open the valve, open the valve. More valve. I guess we have a breeze in here. Uh, did we, I think we handled this a little bit. Uh, regardless, boy, it was going so well. Are yeah, you messing with the valve? It's the school's Oh, maybe it'll go. 
So you see the smoke coming out. The smoke burns like crazy. <laughs> what that does, the problem is our air conditioning is really uh, troublesome. But there's a flame. And so uh, maybe we'll try that. <laughs> well, we were just doing it in the office upstairs. You were doing it in the office? Yes. <laughs> yes, we were. And, uh, let's open her up. Downhill, you think? This is done, that, they do that for safety. <laughs> but see, you can see how the air conditioning's blowing that butane flame. I got an idea. Let's turn the whole thing down. Although it's behind you, let's just see if we get the dog on the floor. Oh, oh, let's give it a shake. Because you're getting liquid in there. Yeah, we didn't anticipate the AC heating, ventilation, air conditioning. Yeah, Bill, that turning it, that was really a good idea. <laughs> Condensation on the outside, and that is from the liberation of the dark. Thank you, Russia. Well, I think that's all we're going to get in this AC. I'm sorry, you guys. But you get the idea. Yeah, Bill, really good. So 
it's the gas that burns, not the wood itself. What, did you have a question, sir? Uh, I think she's too shy now. Okay, who's the other question? There's one over here. Woman in pink. Why do you ride in the universe of energy? Why do you ride in the universe of energy? Let me see. I don't believe I can take a special uh, but her name is Stephanie, <laughs> and she's with uh, Leah, and we can go over there and uh, petition. Thank you. I'm all for it. Yeah. And it's not even the of what you love about it. That's right, it's air conditioning. <laughs> okay, it's yes, men in brown. Oh, is it brown or purple? Yes, sir. Well, you want to show them tell, but uh, but we had to fire a triangle, and that was, I thought that provided drama. And then crazy Sarah comes out just like wham, wham, wham. So I mean, that was pretty good. So that was telling the show, but we got through. The air it just shows you also as a teacher you've had things go wrong. The air conditioning really was uh, traumatic. Traumatic. <laughs> so yeah. So last question. Thank you, sir. Last question. Anybody? I think it's over here. Yes. Guy in hat. Hi. Okay. Project. Let him hear you outside. Blow the roof off the top. I can't hear it. Can somebody be late? I don't remember. <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. I I loved it before I can remember, before I was three years old. And I talk about this a lot. I remember very well watching Beans. Beans. And then in Ripley's Believe It or Not, in the Washington Post, they used to deliver the Washington Post, uh, it said, according to aerodynamic theory, bees cannot fly. Even at a young age, I realized there was nothing really wrong with the bean. The problem was almost certainly with the theory. The theory was messed up, not the bean. So I went on to get a job in Boeing. That's a great question. Thank you all for coming by.